one thing we always come here and it was quite it was a bit of a standing joke i felt like at the golf day it's like you seem to always have more and more staff where you, you <laughs> seem to be growing you've now got these like new officers here this building is like epic yeah, if you can see it on camera it's awesome it's epic boardroom table which must weigh a ton but new staff how do you deal with that is that because you're growing so fast like how do you find the right people and one thing that i love is you're also training people up you're not just hiring yeah, people like yeah. you you're investing in the local area yeah correct yeah it, 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 i think like any business and obviously we, we talk to business owners all day every day and team members and staff is is you know is um the most the prop, arguably most important part of your mm, business yeah. well, almost, at times the most difficult too because you know people change people move people people come in and you've got to embed those people uh but we, we're very lucky i mean we we've we've um got a couple of guys here who started as apprentices um five, six, seven years ago. Uh, uh, and Amy, and actually, you, know, you met, we mentioned the audit. So yeah. Amy Edge is our um, accounts manager. She, she's working with Cheryl now. She manages our accounts every day. Started as a business admin apprentice seven years ago. Um, I think she's still only 22 or something, 20, 23. She's really young, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> whenever it was. Um, uh, and, and that for me, I, I love to see that. Yeah. And it, I think mm -hmm. it arguably comes from comes from my dad because he, he ran his own business, quite entrepreneurial. But he always took on kind of, um, younger lads in in the kind of in the car trade who were perhaps you know a bit rough around the edges gave them an opportunity gave them a bit of training yeah, yeah, yeah. and that's kind of stuck I think um, and, <laughs> but and it's nicer because then you really get to, you get to know each other as a family and the business correct. becomes a family yeah yeah, yeah. And, it feels like that and then yeah, it definitely yeah. runs yeah. through into the people that you have here in there absolutely it is, it's amazing yeah that. absolutely I do love that about it and it might not be for everyone but yeah. but that you yeah. know for the people that it is right for it creates an amazing vibe and a great ex great and and the fact that you come in who aren't here every day and get that vibe and get that feeling and recognize that people seem happy and enjoying themselves that's that's exactly what what, what you know what we want to hear and what we'd want to see achieved it yeah exactly yeah <laughs> the yeah, brand yeah. is working yeah, yeah exactly yeah yeah, you, 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 you've nailed it. Well, that's all I'm going to say. If you, you see him, <laughs> like, my action awesome. here, you've nailed it. It's nice it. to hear. Yeah. So where, do, where do you sit in 10 years then? Like the Iron Market, just bigger, doing all of the same stuff, added on more more arms to it. Yeah, I, th yeah, I think... It's going to be an octopus by then. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I think in, ter in, terms, in terms of where we are, yeah, absolutely. Just, just a continual um, development of that member experience. Yes. Um, and, you know, we, we, we want to be the best at what we do. It's not, you know, whether that's the biggest is, is not, not that relevant, yeah. but certainly being the best mm. and delivering expect, exceptional experience. Qu quality over quantity, I Correct. think, is, is yeah, very absolutely. important, yeah. like, for the clients themselves. Like, we all know, like, even, every single time, like, nothing's ever can, like, lapsy-daisy. Everything is always, like, cross the T's, dot the I's. It's yeah. always yeah. that. And that's what I, being very OCD, I, I just, I bloody love it. I yeah, love it. Yeah. It, it makes me so happy. <laughs> it just makes me happy things like that. Like everything's yeah. always like, and the app itself, like not the Kurt. Do you use the app regularly, Kurt? Uh, no, I not don't. Not so regularly, that. but on the, on the app, you can go on and you can check like, you can see everything. Your finances, you've done, your spending, what you've done, hmm. yeah. all your goals. So you Where can have it gone. set up. Um, Look, that's a, that's a blessing and a curse. And it goes back yeah. to the, the transparency and, and love yes. the transparency where you can see everything there, cost charges, trades, whatever you want to see. But ultimately, that's a double-edged sword because, you know, particularly like we're talking about the last 18 months or so and last year is, you know, you you, you know what's happening every single day. You like, said to you said to me, I remember it, it's so funny, uh, first time signed and set up the first direct debit and I've just kind of never really thought about it. Direct debit just goes out every month. You said some clients like check it every morning. They're like mm -hmm. yeah. addicted to it. And some are just like, yeah. never. I yeah. remember the first yeah. month I was checking like every other day. And then for like now, I'll just leave out. Every eight months yeah. or something. Oh, yeah. I'll just check the it. best yeah. time to check it once a month. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I have a regular. Depends thing. what the month is. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And again, I guess we we again, it's one of those things we give without reservation. We don't we don't give it with terms and conditions and say you can only check it once a month yeah, or, yeah. or on the sixth moon of every Friday or whatever it is. You check it when you want yeah. because I think that's ultimately empowering and it's transparent. Yeah, 
And I, and I think it, then if You're that means that, anything, absolutely like. no. And, I, and I'd, I'd love taking members on on a journey and the fact that people might start not knowing anything about investing. The new update on the app actually looks really, I like the yeah, new update. It's, it yeah, it's really pretty, good. isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. really slick. User interface is nice. pop on it. Yeah, it's it's, nice. yeah. it's like neutral yeah. colors as yeah. well in the background. Don't worry, I know it's not on your phone. I'll put it on that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's, it's really important, that empowerment bit. And, 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 and it, you know, the fact that it means that, you know, when things are are, are a bit rocky, in fairness, I think we're another thing we're very good at. I, I think is 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 keeping people informed and getting a, which means you get ahead of things. Yeah. So we very rarely have the phone ringing, people concerned about what's mm. going on in the markets because they can see their portfolio. Because we're quite often already telling them what's going on and and keeping mm. them informed and actually using technology, which is massive for me. Uh, we're a tech firm, tech first kind of wealth manager. I would say. Is 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 the best way to do that. So secure messaging through the app, delivery of, the messages of reports. And like for example, you were like the other day it was someone, oh, do you want to put your money into an ISA? And just it was a yay or nay. I just said, yeah, exactly. I was like, yay. Yeah, yeah. And Topping suddenly by the next morning it was already done for yeah. me. Yeah. And yeah. then the if you want to, like the regular emails, which again yep. keeps you up to date. Yeah. 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 <clears throat> Not so much always about like this is about the market, it's about actually educational. Education. It's yeah. it's yeah. the one thing that's always forward thinking. It's always about like, well, actually, this may suit your personality. This may be suit you may want to know what's happening yeah. in the market. You may want to know what's happening in the world because this does affect your kind of money, but we're not telling you it's not just about your money. Yeah. And exactly. it's like, well, actually, no, it's quite good. I call it like pub talk like you kind of you know you feel like you're ahead of the game slightly but you may not know the exact same thing but like you know like the good yeah. sense of it you're having that conversation yeah you're having yeah, a conversation yeah. absolutely you're in the loop yeah you yeah. always do yeah. actually say okay have you yeah. read the email curtis uh, <laughs> because, the, because they're, yeah, they're they, so you get, good yes. to loads yeah, yeah. they are very good to be. it's, it's yeah. so yeah. put into idiot proof language yeah. some of the yeah. things because some things are just crazy like it's too much to understand. You just want it. You don't want a lawyer to tell you. You just want it to be normal, so every Tom, Dick, and Harry can understand what you're saying. That's what I appreciate. Definitely. I also think you know. I think our, our profession's guilty historically of being you know, I'll come and see you once a year and talk you through your annual report. What's going on during that year? Mm. You know. Yeah. Whereas I, I think the more touch points and the more contact we can have with our members, the more we're actually able to deliver what we're trying to deliver, which is to help them manage wealth, create wealth, uh, retain wealth, pass wealth on, uh, reduce tax, yeah. uh, whatever, whatever it is within that wealth management remit, the more contact points we have with people and the more we can educate people, the better we're serving them. So why Plus wouldn't we you, do that? you help one client, which I love you, like helping one client, well, actually, well, that helps my other clients as well. And then it's like, well, I've yeah. done this with somebody else. I recommend we try this with you. And like yeah. that sort of kind of cross pollination of, of information yeah. It, yeah. is so useful because it's like, I feel like you as somebody uh, helping overseeing everything, you, you're you learning from everybody. So it it, it just, it me, you don't just, it's not like a one ripple effect. It's two ripples. It's three ripples. Yeah, it, yeah. It times yeah. is two, four, six, eight, ten. It's- I've been accused a few times <laughs> over the over the last five years about whether I'm on commission for EVs, yeah. electric, <laughs> electric cars, just because you know since since I worked, you still got the <laughs> the Audi e-tron. Since I worked worked it through myself, going back when we originally did it and working out actually what's the, uh, you know, uh, is it worthwhile? What does it do? And working through actually, crack, this is a from a business owner's perspective. Yes. What's the good tax benefits of... Uh, Phenomenal. Yes. Yeah. And, and, and Not so much now, is it? Now and then lots of... To... You, st- you still get the corporation tax relief. Ooh, well, yeah, it's still significant. Maybe that. Really and significant. That and, 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 and whilst that's not kind of wealth management advice, and I suppose it, it, it kind of reiterates the point I'm making yeah. earlier, it's not specific investment but it but it is good information for business owners to understand that who but might, if you are planning on getting a nice car it's a great way of saving you've got to have a car yeah. and, 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 yeah. and the point being if you can you know you might not want to spend 100 grand on the car on your own but actually if you spend one and you use use the business and it saves you 25 percent on your corporation tax bill or potentially wipes it out for an, for, a, for a small business and you've got to have a car anyway it's logical so you know again not part of my advice or recommendations, yeah. but it's I'll send send them the spreadsheet and say yeah, this is yeah. what I did. But yeah, if you yeah. it works. if you can fit that into what you're doing, it's a great thing to yeah, do. It's, yeah, it's a, yeah, yeah. Why wouldn't you? Shared knowledge. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's hugely important. Yeah. Just before you go anywhere, we just want to say thank you very much to listen to Freedom Impact Trust. 
we love your reviews so please do leave them because it helps other people find us doesn't it Curtis? yes it does as aj said comment like subscribe mm. share it with a friend share it with the entire world let everybody know that this is the podcast that you guys are listening to and jot down some comments of any financial advice that you want or any questions we'll be happy to answer all of them at the best of our knowledge thanks again for listening guys we hope you've enjoyed it and we love you all yeah we just want to thank our sponsors fint the financial investment app where you can invest from as little mm. as 50 pound a month yes curtis 50 pound a month so easy i like it and don't forget that it's all within three portfolios simplicity it's easy get investing guys have a great day see you later